Why do you get hungry? Why do some foods look tastier when you're grocery shopping? Do you know where your food is grown and how it's transported? If you're a food enthusiast like myself, these are some pressing questions that deserve to be answered. But to be able to understand the nature of our eating routines, we first need to understand the way our food is made. Almost everything that you can eat can be traced back to a farm of some sort. Here, our food is grown as grains or plants and harvested away every year. But farming is a relatively new technology. Agriculture was discovered by our ancestors during the Neolithic Revolution. They discovered that if they planted a seed in the ground, the next year, a tree or plant would grow. With this small amount of information, people all over the world began to grow their food. But farming is just a part of the process to how food gets to your dining plate. First, it goes through a factory, where it's often processed with chemicals and other products. Then it's packaged and transported to your local supermarket. But then why do some foods look tastier when you're grocery shopping? This has to do with your tongue. There are around 10,000 little bumps on your tongue, which pick up taste. Salty, sour, sweet, bitter, and ooh, mommy. Our brains are programmed to crave foods with high salt and sugar, because these foods give us the energy to go on with our day. However, too much salt and sugar is also bad. This can be seen in our fast food. Fast food restaurants have options on their menu, which are known to be high in salt, sugar, and oil. Too much salt is responsible for heart problems. Too much sugar can lead to obesity and other health issues. And too much oil can lead to high cholesterol. Are you still curious about the food that you eat? If so, come down to the New York Hall of Science to check out the newest exhibit, Bon Appetit. This interactive exhibit has all the answers for you on everything from nutrition to healthy eating. Watch short films about eating habits across cultures. Play games to learn about the effects of salt, sugar, and oil on your health and discover the effects of physical activity on the body. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up and share it. And if you have any other science topics or questions you'd like to see in any upcoming NYSCI video, make sure to leave it in the comments below. And don't forget to subscribe and keep learning with us.